anywhere your portion is hiding in this city and in this nation in the name of Jesus if you believe it I declare over you by the God who called me he must look for you in the name of Jesus Listen now. I believe this, oh, I believe this. Let the atmosphere of faith help that lady under the anointing. Please participate in everything we are doing tonight. Don't waste your time. You came here since morning. Don't just watch others and clap. When we are saying shout Jesus, when, when the power of God is moving, touching people, don't just be passive and you are watching and saying, wow, it was a powerful service. That's not what you came to do. This is not a cinema. This is not a museum. You came because there are some things that must give way. You came because your ministry, the mockery and the shame around your ministry, as though God did not call you. You came to encounter grace that will rewrite the narrative of your ministry. So if you're a man of God, a woman of God, don't sit down and see if the anointing is not available for you to receive. If ye being evil, know how to give good gifts. God is a giver. Did you hear that? God is a giver. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I cry unto you, you are a covenant keeping God. I have vowed and you have agreed with it that we will raise a people of influence lord there are people here who love you sincerely but this financial embarrassment has tied their lives down i stand by the prophetic in the name of jesus for as many who believe in this grace and whose heart is open i prophesy to you the grace that lifts men bringing them out of financial shame to a life of dignity that allows you to serve the lord receive that grace now Receive that grace now. Receive that grace now. Businesses, receive that grace now. Families, receive that grace now. Territories, receive that grace now. Anyone who is in any financial situation, you are owing, you lost money, you are in business, there's some kind of financial trouble in the name of Jesus, like Elijah prophesied over the, the, the woman in Zarephath, I speak to your life. May God raise men to bring you out of that situation. May God raise men to bring you out of that situation. Apostle, what do I do to prosper? May my God show you in a dream. In the name of Jesus, the area connected to your wealth, I ask my God to open your eyes in the vision of the night and show you where he has kept the wine and the oil for you. Can I declare favor over you? If it happens only once in your life, it is not favor. There is a big difference between breakthrough and favor. Breakthrough is when the obstacles and the limitations that impede you are taken away. Favor is when under regardless what conditions, you begin to have predictable positive results God compelling men to help you listen I submit to you and at the risk of sounding proud I know what I'm saying forgive me if my statement or anything sounds like boasting or arrogance I know what it means to walk in the favor of God I'm praying for you such as I have in the name of Jesus who is the son of the living God the one who favors men 
I'm praying for you. Let this mantle rest upon your head. May this mantle rest upon your head. May this mantle rest upon your head. Sincerely believers hear me, let me tell you the truth. Most of the things that are written in your prayer request are within the department of favor to give you that testimony, if you will be honest. Let me give you one prayer point. Father, my portion in life and destiny, my prophetic portion, I receive it in the name of Jesus. It must gravitate towards my life. Please open your mouth and pray. That portion of grace allocated for my efficiency. And God is able to make all grace abound towards you. God is able to make all grace abound towards you. season of results that my hand will hold something a season of results please open your mouth and pray my season of results let my life capture your faithfulness I decree it in the name of Jesus Christ laughter you are entering your season of laughter I prophesy it and I decree and declare you receive it by the Spirit, may it be so for you. Laughter, laughter, anything that fights your laughter, I cause it right now. He said, when the Lord turned again the captivity of Zion, we were like them that dream. I prophesy as I hear in my spirit, laughter, laughter, step into your season of laughter. In the name of Jesus Christ. Listen, the power of God is going to come upon you and everything that represents shame and reproach for that family whether you are here represented or prophetically following online in the name of jesus i stretch my hands let the power of god bring to end every activity of witchcraft now every activity of witchcraft now be broken be broken help mama please be broken in the name of jesus be broken now The Lord is showing. I'm going to pray for you. Listen. In the name of Jesus, I'm, the Lord is showing me a family where the ladies don't give birth. This is what I'm seeing. Not, not necessarily in Gombe State. This is another case God is showing me. Ladies, whether they get married, they are not able to have children, and this is like a pattern. It's happened to a number of the ladies you don't have to come out whether you are online or you are in here please I want you to believe God is visiting people's situations in the name of Jesus before I finish with you my Gombe people any spirit that has sat on the womb of the ladies in any family and vowed that they will not give birth by the power that raised Christ from the dead we command those altars broken now We command those altars broken now. Now for all of you, I know some of you, your, maybe your children or your siblings are not here since God spoke about families. As you are standing in faith, I use you as a point of contact. And I pray for your siblings wherever they are in this nation and across the globe. Between now and the end of this year, return with strange testimonies. <laughs> We're going to pray for the sick shortly, but most people, there are those who are not sick in body except they are standing for others. But there is a disease of the absence of favor. You can know that a man's life is not favored, even if you are making money. You should know by now that favor is far more than money. You can have financial resources and not be favored. The difference will be clear. The proof of favor is more than money.
access to the heart of men that's the proof of favor you can have money and everybody hates you there are many things money cannot do i've always prayed for people and you've heard me say it that may you never be so poor that the only thing you have is money hmm. money can fail it's a piece of paper real wealth is men not things men the only reason why things have value is because of men who value them please learn this high level spiritual intelligence real wealth is men when god connects your heart to men he has connected your heart to things and he has connected your heart to money but you can be connected to money connected to things it will kill you destroy you who hates you does not matter but who likes you matters i repeat real wealth is men in the multitude of men not things is a king's honor somebody who can remember you and stand for you and see to it that under their watch you actualize destiny unhindered by any kind of thing whether financial or systemic limitations now that is wealth don't get into that illusion that money does anything no people misunderstand the scripture that says money answering all things what does the bible mean by money because at those times it was not your idea of money that they had real wealth is men that's why Jesus did not come to die for things. Creation was part of the beneficiaries of salvation, but principally it was for men. If you have money, use the money to build relationships. If you have money and the only thing you have is a house and you say, I have an estate, you will be surprised. Estates don't visit you when you are in the sick bed. Estates don't say, I love you. Estates don't say, I'm praying for you. The fruit in your shop will not look at you and say, good morning, sir. 